Hey guys, if you're using Logic Pro X and you want to change the sound of the click to a cowbell instead of the stock sound, this is how you do it. First thing you do is you go to your click track here, and where it says Klopfgeist, we're going to change that to Ultra Beat. We use stereo. Okay, so here's Ultra Beat. Now you can change the click to any one of these sounds, really. Uh, I'm just going to go to the drum bank, percussion bank. And here it says cowbell, tambourine. So we're going to change it to a cowbell. So this is what you do. You go to the record settings up top here, metronome settings. Then you're going to change the beat to the note value of that sound. In this case, it's E1. So we should, we should be hearing the sound of the timbre of the cowbell. So let's say you want to change it to the tambourine, which is the note right above. Let's try F1. So that's how you do it. Now, if you are recording a drummer and they want to play to a, a click that's uh, an eighth note click, here's the way to do it. So right now the tempo map is set to a 120 BPM click, and that's the quarter note. So we want to go to change it to an eighth note. So we're going to go to the division box here and hit this tick box. Now you want to change that division to what they want to hear. So let's say they want to hear eighth notes. So we'll set it to eight. So now we'll change that sound to a tambourine as well. Let's see what that sounds like. So now they can play along to the eighth note click if that's easier for them. And you can still keep your grid in a quarter note if that works for you. I hope that helps. Take it easy.